Alrighty guys, back again with another unboxing, and today I got Sword Arts Online 2 Limited Edition Blu-ray from Aniplex of America. It's part one of four, so this is the first limited edition. Contains the first six or seven episodes. But yeah, uh, there's also a standard DVD and standard Blu-ray this time. So la the first set, season set only had the standard DVD as an offer, but now there's a standard Blu-ray. So if anyone still wants to get the Blu-ray and doesn't want to pay extra for a box and a soundtrack, they, there's a standard edition. Still pretty hefty price for six episodes, six or seven episodes, but still more options is better than nothing. But anyways, this is the Unlimited Edition art box for part one of four again and it has the same artwork used on the Japanese part one set they have that can that's able to hold their you know individual volume sets and has Kirito and his gun gale online avatar and that Shino on the back side is Shino's main weapon I forgot what it's called but it's a sniper rifle and then the special features in the set I'm in a poorly lit room, so I have the uh, light on my camera on, so it's a little bright. But anyways, original Japanese and English audio. But yeah, you can read it yourself. And then the spine for the the single Amory cases is has a loading bar. And the little specs for the set, if it will focus. There we go. All right, let's open it up. As you can see, it has, unlike the first set I, ha I got, it has a nice special wrapping, just like the ja like you know Japanese Blu-rays. The only difference is, oh, I guess there's no real difference. Let's open it up. Ideally, I don't want to damage the plastic packaging, but it looks like it can't be helped. But yeah, it really does feel like a Japanese release because it's, you know, in this plastic wrapping. And it has the little wrap around, which I don't want to take out, but you get the general idea with the art. And again, the spine, the black spine, has the little loading bar. And this is a comparison to the first Sword Arts Online set. Unlike the first set, it comes out on the left side, whereas the first set comes out on the right side. So a little minor difference. I'm assuming it's how the Japanese releases are like over there, you know, from right to left. and individual Amory cases. And I believe it's using the same artwork as the first of individual volumes they have in Japan. Episode count. Three episodes on this one, four episodes on the second one. So yep, seven episodes in this set. This card is just like similar style to the first set except it's not as glossy and the back art is i think the area where you first see uh you know in action in the game this one i think i got it backwards but close enough the soundtrack and it's using, I think, the second volume artwork. All the soundtracks, the track names. Sword Arts Online, original soundtrack, volume one. Very nice artwork here of the, the main city in Gun Gale Online. I think that's what the game was called. Yeah, that's the back arts. Proof of purchase, of course, for all Aniplex 
releases. Survey postcard, survey postcard, the card game, and a little advertisement for a Nisai Koi. Love that show. Still need to pick up the single volume sets. And then the postcards. I really hate opening these up because I'm scared I'm going to damage it while on camera. Oh, it's sticking. But yeah, the little postcard is nothing to write of. It's just the volume set pictures again. And I'm just going to put that away a little later. And then lastly, the little art booklet. So it's pretty much just little screen caps from the episode. And a little, oh, it looks like there's some episode synopsis for each episode. Character profile and art. And yeah, that's pretty much it for part one of Sword Arts Online 2. Again, the spine for the Amory cases, spine for the side, back, and front side. But yeah, anyways, that was my unboxing of Sword Arts Online 2. And I also got my Pit Amiibo from Amazon that I got last week when it was flickering online. Yeah, I'm collecting Amiibos. I'll show you my collections another time. But anyways, thank you for watching.